got some more bad news for Vince McMahon because things, they could get a lot more worse for Vince McMahon. Things continue to look worse for the former WWE CEO. After he resigned from all of his roles within TKO, including TKO executive chairman and the TKO board or on the TKO board of directors after a lawsuit that alleged for him to be involved in sex trafficking and an abuse scandal from a former WWE employee by the name of Janelle Grant. Now, look, John Laurinaitis and WB are also listed in the lawsuit. As previously covered here on the channel, the NDAs that were signed by several mem- women with McMahon were created and signed without the knowledge of WB as he signed them on the company's behalf with the help of longtime lawyer Jerry McDivitt. Now, the NDAs are most likely not enforceable because just like Grant's situation where McMahon paid her $1 million out of the agreed $3 million, that likely makes that NDA null and void. And just like Grant, he did the same with all these other women, which in turns, what does that basically mean in layman's terms? They can talk because he broke his own NDA. Now, while speaking with News Nation, Anna Callis, which is the attorney for Miss Grant, noted that McMahon stepping away from WWE is simply not enough for her client. Now, when asked what justice looks like in Grant's mind, her attorney had this to say. She wants justice because she wants to change the culture that is going on in WWE. She wants to help the other victims. She thinks by speaking out and coming forward for her that others will feel emboldened and encouraged to come forward. Now, her attorney previously claimed that there could be more victims coming forward due to the allegations and civil lawsuit brought against the parties I previously mentioned. Now, McMahon has denied the allegations. Johnny H., John Laurinaitis, he has claimed that he's actually a victim. He's not a predator like McMahon is alleged to be. Now, of course, if this goes to court, which I highly doubt it does, there is a precedent that could be set here. If this goes to trial, okay, this could open up a can of worms that McMahon simply does not want to do. I would be absolutely stunned if he does not write this woman a blank check and tell her to keep quiet like he tried to do before. So we'll see how everything plays out. And keep in mind, everything is alleged. Okay, this is not a criminal case yet, although the feds are looking into it. I previously covered that in another video.